Dinah and I are well on our way to ascend both Bandit and Outlaw Peaks. We've already covered 15 kilometers on our mountain bikes just to reach this trail. Near the end of this valley, we'll head up to a coal that separates the two mountains. It's springtime, and as we hike higher up the valley, snow is melting around us and running down the slopes. We're leaving the valley now and heading up to the coal. Banded Peak looks like nothing more than a pile of loose rocks. It'll be a slog to the summit. We're following the same route as the annual fundraising event called the Banded Peak Challenge. The record ascent of this peak is under two and a half hours, but Dinah and I won't be setting any records. It will take us six hours. Behind us on the left is Outlaw Peak, where we'll go next. Lying next to Outlaw is Mount Cornwall and Mount Glasgow. We finally reached the summit of Banded Peak. We yell, but the wind drowns out our voices. Dinah checks out at Geocache on the summit. Jimmy Hendrix and Peter Gabriel. Party goal. Then we drop back down to the coal and start our ascent up Outlaw Peak. We'll head to the false summit seen on our left. Several minutes later, we're just below the false summit. We've made it to the ridge crest and from here it's a walk to the true summit. Behind us is Banded Peak. As we near the summit of Outlaw, Dinah and I challenge each other to a race to the top. I'm not sure but I think I won. <laughs> <laughs> 